I wanted to do another lip tar video because I got some new ones. These are the latest additions to the whole OCC lip tar collection. I'm really liking these because there are more, um, these are more like neutral or like nude-ish colors. Um, I've already been using Pretty Beige, brownish one. I'll use it on myself. I've been really greedy. I haven't, actually, I like this so much I ha I didn't add it to my, like my makeup kit, like for when I go do other people's makeup. I've kind of kept it to myself. But on my clients, I have been using this one. This one's called Hush, and this one, this one's called Conquest. It goes really nice with lip gloss over it. I actually have on a little bit of Hush right now. Before I even show this one on my mouth, I just want to remind everybody, these, you know, ones like these and this dark brown, like there's a yellow one, an orange one, a blue one, they're meant for mixing and or artistic purposes. These are not lip glosses. They're not regular lip products. These are highly concentrated, pigmented um, lip color. Oh, and too, I'd like to mention again, Lip tars do not actually consist of actual tar. This first one is called Anime and it's a hot, hot pink. And there you go. Just a nice matte pink. I would wear this out. No problem. The next one I'm going to try is called Hush. It's a bit more, it's a little bit more of a pale pink. I noticed that the anime, the hot pink, didn't completely come off. So it kind of made my lips a little bit more, or a little stained pink. So imagine this just a little bit more toned down in the pinkness but this is basically what the color is the next one is called conquest it's a bit more pale so you can see so it might go might go on a little whitish on me yeah so boy and again you only need a tiny, 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 tiny bit. So, uh, just like I thought, it's a bit too pale. But I could take the smallest half of a 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 drop and mix it with some lip gloss and it would be fine. It doesn't have to be worn like this. The next one is my favorite one and it is called Pretty Beige. There you go. Nice and nude. This one is called Fondue. It's like a dark, dark, dark brown. Again, I would probably wear this if I had some really crazy makeup on, but probably meant for mixing. It's good brown, just chocolate, like I don't want to say dark chocolate, but it's brown. Pretty brown. Doesn't get any more brown on that. And last but not least, this one is called Botanical. And again, artistic purposes and or mixing. Can't say that enough. I bet you as much as I've said it throughout this whole video, someone's still gonna go, Ugh, where would you wear that to? I hope you wouldn't wear that out in the street. Hmm. 
Mm. Looks good already. Maybe I should go to Target right now. Maybe. I think I will. I don't want to waste the lip tar, you know. That is it. Just sharing the latest. Hope you try one of these out. And if you are my close to my skin tone, I would definitely recommend Pretty Beige. Hope um, that helped. And thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing if you have. Alright. Bye.